just want to go home, man. I just want to go home. I won't do it no more. Yeah, we know it. And we're going to make sure you don't do it no more. And we're going to make sure some people get to wake up within the next 17 years. You understand me? That don't get to wake up that you left on your clock that you've been bragging about, capping about, laughing about, he he in about with your partner, smoking. Hold on. I, hold on. Let me get him again. Okay, okay, okay. Trey six hundo. Three six double O. Let's go, y'all. Y'all know what's going on, man. Trey six hundo. Three six double O. Trey six hundo. Three six double O. Trey six hundo. Three six double O. Trey six hundo. Yeah. Trey six hundred with a nigga. Uh, you know, we've been talking about the uh, Young Thug and the YFN Lucci, you know, that, that case. Well, they, they offer YFN Lucci 17 years. And he uh he he denied, he said he didn't he he didn't want to do that. But I just want I'm I just want from your perspective, what do you think? Like if you he has a whole a Rico case on him and people that oh, don't told, worry about it, don't worry about it, don't worry about it. I got you, I got you, I got you. I know where you go. Cool. Huh. Listen. Well, that nigga sitting there, um, he's not sitting in lux luxury no more. He, I wish I could show y'all my dog right now. He don't get to lay on his back like my dog right now with his head in the air, laying on his back, legs kicked up without a motherfucking weary in the world. Um, there's no more, um, Grey Poupon. There's no more getting up the fucking ice spot. <laughs> Hello. Now, um, all the luxuries these young niggas been going through, been living for the last, you know, off that good money, good rap money, and you know, they finding out, um, uh, cause niggas will tell on their mama to get out the place. Oh, that's over. Nigga, this my bed? Yeah, nigga, your bed, nigga, that's your mat, nigga. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you talk about a bed. Ain't no motherfucking bed, nigga. You better, you better flip that mat up, nigga. Punch that mat around, nigga, and see if you can find a soft spot to lay in that motherfucker. That's what you do. Me, I would tell y'all what to do. Let me help y'all, y'all out to be watching me. If you want to have your good night's sleep and sleep comfortable at night, I'll tell you what you do. You take your mat right at the end of your mat. You cut it. Slide your razor across it. Now, I'm going to tell you what you're going to get when you get caught. You are going to get your, uh, the, uh, uh, a case for destruction of state property. <laughs> yeah. It is a charge. But cut your mat, make a long story short. Cut your mat at the end. Pull the cotton out the middle of it. Fold your mat up on the end. Make your bed on top of the cotton. That old convict drop. Uh, and every time they came to me and said, Demerson, what the hell happened to your mattress? I said, shit, that's how they gave it to me. Can I get a new one? Know what they'll tell you? Well, no. Well, we ain't got no new ones right now. You ain't about to sleep on it until. Well, thank you. But guess what? Anything that make you uncomfortable, they won't keep you that way. Right. Now, back to what you were saying. That boy is sitting there a couple of months. He realized seventeen years it is. No, 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 no. They offered you seventeen. No, can't do no seventeen years. I can't do another seventeen days in this hole. Mm -hmm. That's how he feeling. That's how they feeling. I can't do another seventeen days. I can't. I can't, man. She's killing me, man. Please, y'all, please. If they let you out right now, little old Lucci, you do good one. Your mind wants your boy. That, that, that plantation ain't no joke. It ain't nothing to come home and brag about either boy. It ain't nothing you want to come home and spend your hard-earned money and get you no merchandise and try to sell that plantation mark either boy. You want out that motherfucker, don't you? But guess what's going to happen to him when he don't take that 17 years? Hold on, let me get, let me get my shit together.
they're going to take that 17 years off the table. You know what that means? No. Oh, yeah, yeah. You yeah get... stay, stay, stay. No, 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 no. Stay there. Stay there, Trey. I, I, li I like the noun question. Yeah. Is it yeah or no, Trey? Which one is it? No, no. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I was just fucking with Trey. Yeah. That was just a little head game right there. Watch this, man. But uh, they're going to come to him again. They're going to say, well, you know, either you take the 17 or we can take it off the table and go to court. And fight it. Uh, let me let me let me get you out of the game. They always want to fight it. You know why they want to fight it? They get more money when they fight and they lose. You like now, nah, cuz how you lose to get more money? Because uh that nigga the one paint. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I told him they offered him the 17. When they offered you the 17, they let you know um, they're not letting you go. My job as a lawyer is to reverse psychology in a dumb nigga head because these niggas ain't used to plantation talk. If they was, they could represent themselves in this court a lot. But these niggas don't know no law. They just know how to break them. You dig what I'm saying? And now that you're here, you're going to have to talk law. But I don't know how to talk law. Then why the fuck did you break it? Right. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. You know what, nigga? Ain't nobody ever came this motherfucker and did something. You ain't the only motherfucker coming and say what you didn't do. Ain't now a motherfucker came this motherfucker. Everybody ain't never did nothing. They just ended up in this motherfucker. Now, nigga, that was in the 1900s when they used to kidnap you niggas and send y'all. They don't have to do that no more. You niggas sending yourselves now because everybody doing crazy dumb shit. And ain't nobody out here helping. Now you got niggas out here promoting niggas to go. But they saying that I'm making it sound cool to go to prison. The fuck? I better not. But what's wrong with Lucci now? Well, he done found out because I can't live in those, I can't live in these conditions. I know. Ain't no pulling up in the Phantom, is it, nigga? <laughs> yeah, nigga. Ain't no goddamn me going to the icebox, telling somebody they cook me an egg this morning. I want my bacon right here, my son. Yeah. Ain't no walking to the store doing none of that. 17 years? Please, I can't do it. I can't do it. Guess what? I'm helping you do it. But guess what, nigga? You're going to do it fast or slow, but guess what you're going to do? You're going to do your time before you go. Uh, niggas laugh at me. Niggas talk about me on these shows and talk about me out on these shows. Uh, when you tell the niggas like that before they go, you can't tell them nothing. I be laughing. That shit ain't funny, person. Yeah, niggas in there locked up. They supposed to be because got niggas out here telling them not to do this, not to do that before right. they go there. Ask me how I know, Trey. How you know? Because everybody told me before I went to prison to stop doing what I was doing, I was going to end up where the fuck I ended up, homie. Right. It's not now, man, in prison if a motherfucker didn't tell you quit doing what you're doing or you're going to end up in prison, boy. You're going to go to jail. You gonna get locked up, man. Stop doing that, man. Stop. It ain't a now person in prison that wasn't warned before they got there. You know how many times my mama told me stop this? Person don't do it. Let's just say it like let's make it easy. Don't you know we know right from wrong? Easy work. Let's try that one. How, how, about, how about that one, Trey? Is that easy? Let's mm -hmm. get basic, fundamental. Let's get re stupid. Let's get retarded. Right from wrong. You can ask. Right the person that they'll tell you they know right from wrong the fuck what are you talking about now niggas in here then when you end up in a in a wrong situation you knew what you knew you was wrong when you did it didn't you just tell just tell me you didn't know just tell me you you didn't know it was wrong to gun that nigga down to walk that nigga down to stand over that nigga and pop off on tell me you didn't know it was wrong that, that I mean that never registered to you well, you know what? You need more than 17 years, I think. Because if that never registered you what you were doing and we offered you 17 and you can't run with that and take that and snatch it off the table and go and tell God, thank you for the 17, I'll shoot for 14. That would you tell him. See, you better play smart. If he was smart, he'd tell him, no, sir, I won't take 17, but I will take 15 right now. Um, I'll take 10. 
Mm-hmm. And when they say not the 10, I'm mean, going to give you 10. Well, I'll take 15. I give my steps on. I did that every time I went to jail. Nigga, one of these d- niggas go down and go, I was down there 20 years, you stupid. You. I was down there 30 years. I did 20. I did 15. Well, y'all the slow one. I was smart enough to go in there. Nigga always talking about Ferguson. Man, Ferguson. Ferguson just one plantation I visited. Nigga, I was like a I was like a runaway slave. Nigga, I was transferred from camp to camp. <laughs> nigga, I've been on Brownsville. Hold on. I've been on Brownsville unit, Militant unit, Hutchison unit, the Goree unit, the Gurney unit, the Lindsay unit, the, the, the Dawson unit, the Central unit, the um the Ramsey unit. And guess what? And I've been on Ferguson unit. That's 10 units in touch, nigga. You niggas crying about me being on one. Guess what? Oh, hold up. And I was a stand-up nigga. Every unit. Hey, I'm from Ferguson. I'm your... I've been on plenty of white men plantations. I got shuffled around. That's why my stories are so long. That's why I can tell so many stories. I can show y'all stories where I can tell you stories on other Ferguson, Ferguson, that just one plantation that my lost as a man visit. That's why I know these niggas that get off of these 17 years, them niggas is fine. <laughs> you know how long 17 years? Them niggas won't out now. They won't they Gigi Wentworth. <laughs> it's my freedom and I want it now. <laughs> yeah, you you wish that um I played to God. I never got myself in that much trouble, Trey. I wanted to come home, cause I wanted to come. Home. I know how them niggas feel. Them, <laughs> cause don't you know niggas are telling on their dead homeboys to get out there though. Niggas were telling on their mama. Niggas were telling on their own friend partners. You know how many niggas that came home from snitching? Don't nobody want to be in that mother. Especially not niggas that's used to having something in life on this side. You got some niggas that'll do something to go live in prison because they don't got nothing on this side. Now, the niggas that ain't got nothing. Yeah, you hear what I said. You got niggas out here to do crime just to go live in prison because there's nothing out here. No family, no right. nothing. They'd rather be in prison getting three hots and a cock, get something to eat every day, go commit a crime, catch one of you young taxpaying people, walk up and cut your throat, set the knife on top of your body and wait for the police to come get them. They don't want to go home and just pray that they don't get a death penalty. They're not going to take nothing from you. They're going to rob you for nothing because they don't want the capital murder. They just want the murder that will never get them to come home because mm-hmm. they ain't got nothing to come home for. You got niggas that's been in prison so long when they get ready to come home, they'll kill them just to stay. See, niggas don't tell y'all like that. Uh, niggas like YSL, he ain't used to no Trey. 600 you know what I'm saying? He ain't used to that. He ain't used to no trade. He ain't used to um getting up, being able to go to the ice box and get, you know, you know, when you take luxuries from certain people, niggas don't work no more. You hear me? Uh, like I say, they will do anything. Look at nigga say. He don't want to take 17 years. Nigga, you done did here for the last 17 years. That's a that's a that's that's about just a year for each year you over them. Yeah, you came up lucky for the 17. You already been locked up, so you get a little time served, man. Them niggas looking at that 17, they crying, they boohooing, and one thing they know, I can't do 17 years, man. <laughs> but you were just stepping like a killer the other day, beating on your chest, his mind out here, throwing your jewelry in nigga face, blinging and shining, and putting your bandanas on, and running up, chopping niggas down, and with the drill team. Now a nigga can't do 17 years and y'all got niggas in the grave doing life. I'm going to let you niggas soak in it for a minute. I'm going to let you see niggas crying about 17 years mm-hmm. and they got niggas doing life. That they, that, they, that they get the cap and roll up and smoke in front of everybody. Put put on the end there, get the, oh, I got who, what they call, it ain't got so popular to talk about dead folks. Now niggas they put them in the weed now and wrap up and wrap about them. 
them niggas don't get to come back to say um nothing. And these niggas crying about 17 years. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna let that nigga soak in that 17 for he don't gotta take it. Tell him don't take it. Cause you know what? When he don't take it, he gonna be just like them niggas that he get to smoke in the blunt. He's gonna be doing life some right. don't take it if he don't want to. But guess what? Um uh, you know what he's looking at? He's looking at I'm I'm already this age. And when I go do this Rico charge, uh, y'all know the feds don't have no mercy. Uh, and I'm saying that to say that it, they don't got good time, niggas. Yeah, they tell you 17 years, you doing 17 years. They probably let you out nine months early, send you to a halfway house and let you sit over there and bake and try to get um mentally adapted to society by leaving one foot in and one foot out at a halfway house. I could never do a halfway house. I thought every time, bitch, if I'm out, I'm gone. Yeah. Nigga, y'all know I was I was a runaway slave. I'm a runaway slave. That's why every time they come get me, um, shh, they need the helicopter, the bird, and the house surrounded before they even knock on the door. They yeah, already know he's a runner. Ask him. OG pressure, I have I do have a baby arrest. Not one, several. I am Kuta Kente, the real one. When they <laughs> jump out, I'm gonna run. Him put, and then I always say, I ain't I swear to God. I put this on everything I love. I ain't never been caught when I ran. I make the run blocks and blocks, bring out these. I be watching. Nigga, I hid in a dog house. Somebody backyard in a dog house all motherfucking night for them hoes to leave. I ain't coming out this hoe. I can hear them moving on down the street on that, but I know one thing. They know I'm in the area, so guess what? Me and the motherfucking dog, um, scoot over, dog. Shit. <laughs> I know it. Yeah. Scoot your bitch ass over, and I hope you ain't got no fleas back there. God damn it, because uh, I'm finna cuddle up with your bitch ass. You finna be my pillow tonight. <laughs> yeah, you mean. But, um, if he'll take that 17, shh, he's gonna, he gonna end up going to trial, you know, because some of these niggas, let me tell you the game is the larger game is to make these rich niggas think that I got you in court. I got you, don't worry about it. We can beat this. Let me tell y'all the game. It's gonna always, whenever a lawyer tell you we can beat this, <laughs> uh, <clears throat> if he do, if he do, he better have Johnny Cochran money. Yeah. Please, 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 young men, please, gentlemen. All you need to be in jail, listen to me, or in jail on your way to the plantation, uh, and you have a master for a lawyer. Oh, they call him court appointment. I heard niggas say that to me. I got me a good court appointment lawyer. You dumb. Never in my life heard of a good court appointed lawyer. Because guess what? Let me give you the catch 22 on that. He's court appointed. That means who do he work for? They just told you what he worked for. He's what? The court. Bars. He's And these niggas in here thinking that this don't work. Bars. He's court appointed. Let him. Go in there and get you free. Shit. He'll be looking for a court appointed lawyer the next day. Mm -hmm. Shit. Let a nigga that worked for the court end up going against the court and winning. See, when they give you a court appointed, you get two options, such as a plea bargain or trial. Which one you want, nigga? What you mean by that? You get one of the two. That's it. Ain't nothing else on the table. Nothing. No, ain't no freedom on the table. Ain't no, I can't go home. I just want to go home, man. I just want to go home. I will not do it no more. Yeah, we know it. And we're going to make sure you don't do it no more. And we're going to make sure some people get to wake up within the next 17 years. You understand me? That don't get to wake up that you left on your clock that you've been bragging about, capping about, laughing about, he he in about with your partner, smoking. Hold on. I, hold on. Let me get him again. Smoking on the ops, blowing them. It, it was funny, wasn't it? It was all cap. Uh -huh. Just for the wave, nigga. You hear me? I'm gonna let y'all ever say that again. It was all cap just to join the new wave, the new trend that's out here. It was uh -huh. all cap for the wave, but let me let you know I don't need a cap for the waves, nigga. I don't need a wave cap, nigga. You hear me? Bars for the wave. 
I don't need a way cap for the cap. But guess what? That's gonna be one crying ass nigga. But let me tell you what's gonna fuck out. I I, I sit back and look at these niggas, and they, it, you know, uh, I've already been in them situations. I just I just named y'all ten prisons I done been to, and I probably left some. I ain't, and I ain't tell you about my county jail time. God damn. I ain't mentioned my 28 incarcerations in the county. Mm -hmm. I used to live in the system. I stayed, if I wasn't doing prison time, I'm doing county time. Uh, the world was a vacation to me. I come out here and 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 and, and, up. and I and, and, and uh the, the thing is I was so proud about it. God didn't kill me out, bro. God didn't let nobody kill me out. Uh give niggas get to see another day. Niggas that they rap about don't. Hello. Offense. Uh, when did niggas start going to the courtroom praying for leniency? When, when? Yeah, thank y'all. Y'all have to sit there. That'll stop people from calling. When I have to go in the courtroom and start pleading for leniency? Could your family please forgive me? I just, I, I, I didn't mean it. I just, I just wanted to, you know, to tell them I'm sorry. Can y'all forgive me? Yes, we forgive you. If he tell us, if you can make him tell us to forgive you, we gonna forgive you. Who is he? The same motherfucker. If he can say something, can tell us something again, we'll let you go too. I mean, other than that, nigga, if you can't make him say nothing, we don't want to hear you say nothing either, nigga. Because that's all loved ones want to take people back that you took from them, that you kept about, you laughed about, and that person didn't have nothing. He was just a target. He was just this. He was just something to be doing. He was just somebody to slide on because I want to know if you and the other niggas ain't dead, then why? If you and the other nigga into it so much, why ain't now one of y'all dead? Why is always somebody around in the midst? Because you niggas too coward to look at each other eye to eye like I said, I walk up on niggas. It's a, it's, it's a whole difference, um, Trey, uh, of respect out here in the streets, even in the system. Uh, they got niggas on here talking about safe prison, making niggas think it's cool to safe. You can go now it's safe. And you niggas ain't checking. You niggas ain't doing nothing down there. Who the fuck tell people that? Who who try to who try to take the haunt at the movie? If I make if I make it a haunted story, let me leave my shit like that. Niggas ain't like that down there. It wasn't like that when you were down there. Then guess what the young niggas say? Oh man, I might as well go on. That nigga lying, cuz he ain't like that no more. Now, cuz we down there chilling, kicking it with the homies in that hole, cuz. Go on, tell them that, D. Cause that's what them niggas make it sound like when I'm trying to tell the young niggas one thing and they trying to tell them because he wasn't doing it. And I'm gonna tell y'all something. Let me, let me give you, let me give you a right hand to God real right quick. I'm the reason niggas don't want to come to that Ferguson because I'm that reason. I'm one of, I'm one of those reasons. And guess what? I created a whole lot of reasons around me like that of niggas. Cause guess what? You got niggas that's gonna come home and convince more niggas to go that way in the wrong way. Uh, my reason should have been the best reason. No other reason. Right. Not arguing with niggas about it wasn't like that when I was there. He wasn't doing it when I was there. He wasn't. And all them niggas straight. You niggas sound like bozos to sit here and uh, get a plantation power. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna let y'all niggas so nigga. I talk. Look, I don't tell prison stories. I tell what I went through in prison. Did you hear what I'm saying? Um, I, I don't sit here and talk about. I'm not a day room nigga because I don't know what goes on in a day room because I don't stay in a day room. We niggas sit in a day room. Nigga, I'm finna go to, nigga, I wouldn't get caught. Nigga, tell them niggas to come to the rick yard where I'm in. Where, where King shooting them and all them niggas didn't want to come hang it every day where I was at. These niggas just get to come over here and have the power and talk about it because they did all the time. I wouldn't give a fuck how long you was down there. I went in there. I did what I did as a man. To listen to me, homie. Listen to me. Let me give you something. To survive, homie. You hear me? That's what I went in there. A man to survive, and I did that. Um, just like this internet. Once you go in a certain way, nigga, that's that nigga you gotta be. See, I could have even went in there and changed my life around, but I already went in there. That nigga, I'm a crip. Yeah, that was on my back before I went in there. That's what I stood up on. That's what I stood up on. And you got these niggas that yelling at they super crit when they, let me tell y'all something. 
even the young blood and the YSL, all them niggas in trouble, them niggas coward. Because them niggas scared to go on, do their time and come on home, nigga. Ain't no way Percy gonna be sitting in this motherfucker with all these summer bitches with these suits on and cases. When I went to the courtroom, that's all I seen was suits and cases. Yeah. Suits and cases. Y'all will catch that, yeah. When I went to the courtroom, all I seen was suits and cases, nigga. Niggas walking around with briefcases in their head, throwing them on the table. That's all I seen. Right. Suits and cases, nigga. But anyway, um. Uh, I'm not making it to the courtroom. I just want to see the judge. Come on, quit playing with us. Okay, okay, okay. Trey six hundo. Three six double O. Let's go, y'all. Y'all know what's going on, man. We need that drop, man. We trying to get a twenty five k, y'all. We 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 trying to push before this year. We trying to reach, you know, reach our quarter at twenty five k. We gonna get y'all the best, man. Um, uh, all the best. We coming at y'all like this every week, so y'all can't um uh, be behind or be misled. Goddamn me, um. Uh. Only thing on here is good food, man. We feed, man. We trying to get um uh, food for thought, man.